Right, take two on climbing to Mount Rocco's Psycho Hole, that's highest peak. Given last time we set off too late and then it was nightfall by the time we hit the top and I almost died of cold. And we've got a lovely sunny day, it's about 11 o'clock in the morning. And we're setting off for the hike, should be there in three or four hours. First off, pit stop at Corpu, our super supermarket to get lunch. Pack of eight tiny sandwiches for 300 yen. That is just shy of four dollars and just over two pounds. And then my favorite thing that I've seen for a while is a box drink of sake, which will make for an interesting hike. Okay, what altitude are we working towards roughly? Nipple cutting altitude. Oh. 285. 285 meters. meters. Yes. Okay, meters. <laughs> as opposed to kilometers. That or, or miles, I'm pretty sure it's meters. Oh, very informative. This is quite possibly to scale. Pick a direction in a forest and just walk straight. Uh, don't go follow, don't follow any paths, just go straight. That's how I play Minecraft. What checkpoint number are we, Chris? Both say five, I say four. Yeah, we have different systems. I'm, I'm doing Fahrenheit, he's doing Celsius. That's <laughs> a little bit less I think it means it's in four more kilometers. <laughs> there it is, Sumiyoshi River. Okay, we believe this water to be drinkable. Over. No, we're not even halfway yet. How do you feel about the walk? Well, I've placed myself thus far. Uh, natural physique. Otherwise, we fatigue inevitably. <laughs> I think we'll see more oh. and more stop <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay, still 2.3 kilometers left. It sort of seems, uh, you know, against logic to be going at such a downwards uh, gradient, so close to the mountain. If we were playing Uncharted, Nathan Drake would just run up this. Yeah. Chris said he'd beat me to the top, so I have to run every time he gets near. <laughs> okay, we're about to reach the top where the main road is for people who cheat and go by car. And then it's just like five more minutes until the very top of the mountain. Oh. Camera or video? Camera, I mean video. <laughs> cameo. Hey, it's your cameo in my video. <laughs> it is quite. Yeah, cam Everyone looks so full of energy. I think that stone there is the highest point, so nearly there. There it is. Not to disrespect my fellow hikers at all, but I was first to the top. Oh, Tsukarisama! Arigato, Tsukarisama! Mwah! So we're almost a kilometer above the sea, but we can still see it. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Hello, everyone. Yeah, we've defied odds and science and physics. You know, we have done none of those We've things. We've battled elements. Not so much fire, but uh, air and water. A bit of mud as well. Uh, if by battle water do you mean we got thirsty and then drank from the river? To a point, although okay. we're treacherous so we stamp leaves as well. So. Now I'm being hotly Vlo pursued. <laughs> it's vlogception. I'm I'm <laughs> making a vlog about Chris vlogging. You see, this is this is what what it comes to. It's YouTube competition. So Japan has blown my mind yet again. My box drink came with a detractable straw. Incredible. I don't know exactly what I'm looking at, but I love it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right, well that was an absolute mission. 
We're on the way back down now. I'm not as tired as I thought I'd be. All jeans. So that makes sense. So Laurie, no how do you cope with wildlife up there? That's the only problem. The wildlife is awesome. I keep getting cobwebs oh. in my face though. I kind of ended up massively far ahead of the crowd because I started running and couldn't stop. Running down the mountain is kind of like DDR but with like a more complex visual cue and a greater penalty if you mess up than a low score. Right, nearly back in civilization. We're going to celebrate our triumph by going to an all-you-can-eat at World Buffet in town centre. So that's going to be good. And we come back to civilization.